Guys, I want to talk to you about concrete and the prep work, I'll, and I'll be short about it. I just want to talk to you about the uh, proper way to use a roller tamper or any anything that does tamping. Um, so roller tamper, Marshington, Marshallton, I'm crushing on. Um, well, they're they're pretty good. They're they're pretty good at sponsoring channels and things like that. So we're gonna give them a little kickback that way. So Marshallton uh, roller tamper specifically, and of course all tampers will come out to the same result, but roller tampers. So now when you roller tamp, you're going to screed first. So you guys, I'm talking to professional contractors, obviously. The homeowner is not going to buy or bother buying a roller tamper. So after you screed, you run a roller tamper across there. The, the two, the roller tamper with the, uh, the four foot roller tamper, for example, it has the surface area that's larger than, say, a three-foot roller tamper. So it's going to give you less pressure as it rolls across your surface. With that said, you can get on your, your uh, after your screening, you can get on roller tamping pretty fast. Roller tamping is a nice step to put between bull floating or floating your surface as it will push down the stones so consistently, very consistently, and give you a nice cream. I mean, that cream it's going to give you is going to be beautiful. It's going to be about mm, three eighths of an inch cream reveal, if you will, but as it as it uh, um, imprints across the concrete. Now, it's not going to leave a three eighths inch cream because you're going to bull float right after that. But it's going to give you that leveling effect of your after your screening. If you get on it, if you wait a few minutes, you'll have less of an imprint. So the sooner you get on it, so wet concrete, of course it's going to dip down and give you a higher paste level. And you really don't want a higher paste level above your, on top of your concrete there. You want to, you want just the right paste level, just the right amount. So you wait just a moment, depending on your temperature, you learn, you learn your temperatures. You know, it's a small, very small learning curve. Um, you roller, you roller tamp. So you're going to roll it's going to tamp or roll down beautifully so the stone. At that point you're going to follow up with your bull float. Um, you're going to float your surface. If you do it then, do not allow your, your, uh, your, your roller tamp surface to set too long. What happens is you'll lose your plasticity and your paste. You want to roll a tamp and then you want to go ahead and join your paste back together with the, uh, with the bull float. It's not a panic, but you don't want to let your cr uh, crust build up or your plasticity to go down. In other words, don't roller tamp everything and then come back and bull float everything, uh, depending on how small the job is. But the larger jobs, uh, roller tamp as you go and, and bull float, float everything. And then you'll see how beautiful it is. And you'll see if you're getting on it too soon. You're getting on it too soon if, if you don't like your floating and you see the edges digging in. You're getting on it or too soon if you've got too much paste when you're roller tamping. You're getting on it too late if you roller tamp and then you bull float and you still have a, it's not a, a, a beautiful cream, a, a beautiful paste. So you'll see the happy medium between them all and it's the curve is so small. It's so small, the learning curve. All right, so that's my take on roller tamping. I love them. I loan them out. Last time, I have one I use all the time. I loaned it out to a contractor. I loan them out to contractors frequently. Last one I loaned out to a contractor. Liked it so much that he decided it wasn't a loaner. They're $200, guys. $200. Go buy, go buy one. Um, with that said, uh, you know, I'm going to, I'm now working on Marshallton's product that they use, a roller screed. I will give you an update if the, uh, I'll give you an update on that soon on the roller screed. All right. Take care, guys. Bye.